What are you doing here today? We are doing the backpack buddies. Actually, it's my first time to do backpack buddies, although the company sponsored this, and, but I have been doing other stuff with Interfaith. What I've learned from this is that uh, there are so many, over 100,000 kids, I think in North Carolina, that are, are in need of, of this service. And that uh, when they leave school after lunch on Friday, a lot of those kids don't have a meal until Monday morning, which was eye-opening. I think we, we all volunteered here to realize that um, we're very lucky. And there's a lot of people out there that are in need. And this is a good way to get back and, and help. Yeah, like my son, the t-shirt says, good. Where you live? There we go. No, not you. Here. Yes. So how does it make you feel? Knowing that kids are going to eat this weekend because of you. It's very humbling. I mean, you know, we come here and do this, and I know it's two hours of our work time. You know, we could finish two hours to work in the office, but at the same time, this is a different kind of work. It's, it's very worthwhile, absolutely. We just want to encourage anybody out there to just go ahead and volunteer. And, and it is always a good cause. I mean, I see your, your trucks out there, and you know, now I'm starting to be a little ambassador and explain people what Interfaith Food Shell is all about. And I think it's more of awareness and word of mouth that would bring a lot more people educated on what you like to do and how you help the community. And thank you so much for what you're doing. Well, and thank you. It's people like you that help us feed the 1,300 children each week and make a dent in the 100,000 here in the Triangle. So we couldn't do it without our volunteers. And we love our ambassador, Edna. <laughs> You fell in love with us and we fell right back in love with you. Absolutely. Thank you. I mean, absolutely. And, and I will continue to do it. And spread yeah. the word. And spread